Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. Uh, I like, like, I don't like, like, it's different. Like, I don't like niggas, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's different. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, no, you didn't. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, 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 Because it's just like you be portraying this gangster image, and then I, I am gangster, like super gangster. Like I slapped out of anybody to play with me. I'm not saying you what. <laughs> no, thank you. That don't have nothing to do with my like how like what I what I like or what I do. There's, no, there's nothing I'm not wrong. sad. I'm not there's, like, there's nothing. There is nothing wrong with being. Like wow. Hey man, let me just let me weigh in, man. Uh, check it, man. Uh, Boss Talk 101, man. Uh, Brick Wolf Pack, man. Um, this is this is something that pops up. It's been popping up, and, and at the end of the day, you know, um, that's the way the culture. You know, this 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 one thing is. It's not an easy subject to talk about when you look at. You know, it's. I actually have people in my family that that have pretty much said that they was gay or came out, and and you know, this is a part of the culture we in. Um, man, I don't know, you know, was this a, the right way for Brick to come out with it and just say it like this in the middle of a lie with, with you know, with whoever? Um, I really can't, I really can't, he asking, he, he's pretty much asking, are you judging? And I'm like, man, you know, you know, you when you put this out here like this, of course, you know, you can expect to be judged, right? You know, this is uh this is something I started seeing yesterday, just circulating, 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 and it's something um you know that you're probably gonna be seeing more and more of you know uh, young rappers that's uh, coming out or saying things that you know they feel a little bit you know easier to say. I, I brick wolf pack, you know he I've seen him on the say cheese interviews, I've seen him on the real life street stars interviews. I I, I he straight up Texas, but. At the end of the day, you know, um, I think he moved to California. But like I said, he asked, you, are you judging me? Because he's bi, you know, it's a tough, it's a tough situation for a lot of his friends that, you know, and it's going to be tough for him. It's going to be an uphill battle. I remember when Frank Ocean and all type of people uh, that Sam Smith got, a lot of people have came out and, and, you know, let the world know who they are, where you can expect the backlash. Even when you see Young Thug, you know, putting on a dress, whether he was or whether he wasn't, people, it's going to strung up things on the internet. You know, I'm definitely, um, you know, know he better have some strength to come out with something like that. You know, um, I just really, you know, I feel bad for him, you know, for, for, for what's about to happen when it come down to, you never know how many people in his inbox, you don't know what this guy's pretty much going through when it come down to the, 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 the backlash stuff is gonna come with this. And I know y'all thinking, wow, man, people not gonna say nothing. We live in a culture today where people can do whatever, but it's not like that. This internet, it's, it's crucial. It, 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 it's, gonna, it's gonna come back at you in a way that you would never expect. You know, people definitely gonna be in his inbox. People definitely gonna be saying stuff you see the uh, you see the guy out here with him now. You know he he not he it, it's funny you know and 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 a lot of people are saying a lot of stuff. And then you know I I just don't understand you know how this how to you know what made him come out like this you know. Uh, and then the dude said you know dog P R E he didn't he didn't die for that you know because everybody gonna have the opinion about what he's done. Big Wolf Pack. I like I said, do you think that he should have came out with it this way? Or should he have done it a different way? How do you do it? You know, when it comes down to it. You know, I've been married to the same woman for so many years. 
I'm definitely, um, you know, a family man. I stand for family. I think family is gangster, you know, but at the end of the day, other people out here doing whatever, you know, I can't judge whoever. I guess I can because in the, in the belief system that I believe in, I can say whatever, I can judge, but I can be judged too. That words say, judge you not that you not be judged for what, what measure you use will be measured back to you. And if I judge somebody or measure something with a righteous judgment, then there's nothing to be said. If I say, hey, you beautiful to a girl, then at that point, she's going to be like, uh, oh, thank you. But at the end of the day, that was a judgment. Now, if I say, look at you, man, you're, you're a booger wolf. You horribly looking and you look bad and you dirty. And, and, and then she's going to say, hey, look, and, and don't judge me. Don't judge me. That's, what, that's, the, that's the way that's going to go. So all I'm saying is you never know what uh, this whole situation is like. You know, you just never know. So at the end of the day, you just got to, you know, you, you, you got to pray for him and his family. You know what I'm saying? Because I've never seen this coming. I, all I know is I was trying to figure out a way to basically – come out here and say something that may help his day and the people who are going to criticize him day. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what to tell him, you know. All I know is a lot of people, you're going to start seeing a lot of a lot of these rappers, a lot of these people coming out openly with how they feel about their sexuality. And ain't nothing much you could do about it. All you got to do is sit back and look and see where the chips fall. Like I said, it's, it's crazy when you start to look at you know how society uh has developed in all these years when i was young you didn't never heard nobody come out and say nothing these guys was hiding it a lot of people and 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 people was 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 suffering in silence or committing suicide and doing all kinds of stuff back then so i don't really know you know if it was something that he felt like he wanted everybody to understand where he stood in his sexuality i really don't know what made him come out like that but I can say the one thing you got to understand is a lot of them that's, that, that ain't coming out is probably doing what he's doing. Think about that for a second. You know, Rick Wolf ain't, 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 ain't by himself. Rick Wolf, he, he ain't by himself. It, it, it's some more. And I guarantee you, and, and, and they're not coming out. You know what I'm saying? They basically just, you know, undercover with it. So you never know what these people are doing. And, and like I said, it's their business. It's their business. But when you put your business out here on the Internet... Just like if you was heterosexual, it's going to be something where people are going to judge you at that point, And you can be ready for that. Ain't no ill fans bust about it. When you put it out here, that's what you can expect to come with it. So at the end of the day, you know, you look at him and you say whatever. But I'm telling you, it's, it's more that's out here. And at the end of the day, I just say every day after the end, you got to think about it. You know, um, he probably been holding this in for a long time. I don't know. I really don't know his stance on it. I don't know why he came out with it. Uh, but I do know if it's a matter of him living or dying, I would rather him come out and say something. Uh, do I agree with it? It's not me to have to deal with it. You know, I, of course, I'm, I'm not with it. But at the end of the day, I'm not. It's his life. You know, uh, I'm, not, I'm not. I can't tell him what to do. I'm not going to say that's not my lifestyle. But at the end of the day, that's what he chose to do. And he chose to come out with it, man. Brick Wolfpack, man. Like I said, kudos to you for even coming out. A lot of people are going to be talking about it. I don't know, like I said, as far as I, I definitely, you know, you could all, you know, I've had uh, people on my show uh, from the from the alphabet community, uh, several of them. I don't, I, it's not nothing that I condone, but at the end of the day, to each his own. And uh, like I said, a lot of my family and people that I'm around have seen have been affected by whatever the situation may be. And like I said, you know, I just I'm praying for everybody in that instance. I'm praying for everybody. So, man, make sure you guys get in the comment. Let me know, man, what you think about Brick Wolfpack coming out and, uh, you know, expressing his sexuality before the world and um, in this manner and in this climate. Let me know what you think. Boss Talk 101. Yeah, what a boss is talk. Review. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see.